What the hell, where has this website been all my life? If I could marry a pair of pants, it would be these. I got zebra pants. What is all, should we do like a, should we spin into it? Like a, hi guys. What's up guys, welcome to my channel. Today, we're gonna be doing another haul because there's only so many things that you can do during quarantine and one of the ways that I've cured my boredom is through online shopping. Before I get started, I do want to quickly say that this video is sponsored by Nasty Gal. Their spring and summer collection is absolutely gorgeous. It's to die for. I would highly recommend their website if you need some cute summer pieces, even though by the looks of it, it looks like we're not going to be able to leave our houses um, during summer, but at least we can, you know, continue getting dressed up in our rooms because that's, that's our form of entertainment now. Like that is how we keep busy, which is kind of sad. But it's, but it's true. Wow, 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 wow. The first item we have is this cropped long sleeve. And we have all watched Outer Banks, I'm pretty sure. Everyone who's watching this has seen Outer Banks. And this really gave me Sarah Cameron vibes. I feel like this is something that she would wear just like this. And it's kind of wide. Like the neck is wide, so it kind of like goes off your shoulder a little bit, which I love. I absolutely love it when like my collarbone is seen because I think it's one of like the nicer features of a girl body. So flaunt your collarbone. I also really like the sleeves because they flare out, but there's a cut so that it doesn't look like weird. It's not like really long. It's a nice detail that I really appreciate. It's like this, quite lovely, isn't it? All right, ooh, okay, I'm so excited for this. It's this black crop top and it has cinching sides. I absolutely love it when a dress or a top or anything has this detail on it because I think it makes your whole body look so much more flattering. It makes it tighter, but it also doesn't make it look too tight to the point where it looks like you're Kim Kardashian and you're wearing one of her really tight dresses and like you can't breathe. It's super thin, although it's a long sleeve, it's literally like the thinnest material I've ever, ever worn. And it's so soft, but it's not see-through, which is really great. And it just very flowy. It's not gonna keep you like super hot during the summer like it's just perfect if you're like going out with your friends at night this is something I wish I had last summer and I didn't so I just decided to get it this summer and oh so so perfect it's the see-through knit cropped long sleeve and I specifically bought this as like a bikini cover-up my sister has something similar to this and I really really liked it it looked super good on her and what I love about it is that it actually comes with the bottoms it's not like you have to buy them separately which is literally the best thing in the world yes this is still see-through I didn't buy this to like wear normally like on the street but this is perfect for beach cover-ups and beach cover-ups is literally the only clothing item I wear during the summer because I'm only at the beach during summer and it's perfect. Although it's a long sleeve, again, it's not gonna keep you like hot because it's literally like there's holes in it. The next item that I got, I specifically purchased for quarantine because I realized that we're gonna be in this a lot longer than I anticipated. So I actually need to start uh, buying clothes that I can wear at home. I got this set and I'm so, so glad that you can buy these together. You don't have to buy them separately, which is so annoying when brands do that, but thank God Nasty Gal doesn't. It's really basic. It's a staple closet item. I'm surprised I didn't even have something like this, but they're just black sweatpants, a matching crew neck, super simple literally you can get both of these items for the same price as one sweatpants at like another store which is insane to me because like why would anyone not want to take up that offer just i don't get it the next store i went to i went to i wish i went to the store no the next store i ordered things from is a store that i've actually never even heard of i stalked their instagram i stalked their website and i was like okay, what the hell, where has this website been all my life? And I just ordered a bunch of things. It's called The Crypt and I'm absolutely obsessed with them. It's literally my favorite store right now. Their prices are reasonable. There are some items that are kind of overpriced, but not like freaking IMG or something where they literally charge like 800 bucks for a pair of pants. No, they're not like that. It's around like 40 to 50. Let me show you what I got. The first item I got is one of these like super trendy uh, cropped like zipper shirts if that makes sense. There's zippers on both ends so you can make it as you know showy as you like. It has a nice collar, it's ribbed, it's a long sleeve, it's a perfect height, it's not like super mini so you can wear it at like a family function if you like zip it up properly but then it's also like if you were to leave your family function and meet up with your friends and go to a fancy like party 
you could, you know, adjust some and get some. This item is a little bit out of my comfort zone, but I was just like, fuck it, like, we've been in quarantine. I am done being in my comfort zone because once this is all over, I am literally, like, going full out. I'm doing everything that I've wanted to do, but I was scared to do in the past. No. Honey, when this is over, like, I don't think anyone's gonna have that same, like, shy and, like, insecure mindset because we're all gonna come out of this, like, boss-ass who are just enough and can't take it anymore and we're just gonna show her full colors. So, with that being said, I got zebra pants. There are these high-waisted zebra pants that flare in the bottom. They're like bell bottoms. The fit. Oh, the fit. I'm petite. I'm a petite girl. I don't have an ass. I'm not that tall. I'm 5'3". And this is an extra small and it fits me. Like, hello. When has that ever happened? I am really just amazed by this store. They're, they keep doing something. I'm waiting for the catch. But there isn't one. I don't know what's going on, but I'm not complaining. They are so cute. Like I said, they're super wild. They're really fun. I cannot wait to style them and wear them out and just show everyone my new zebra pants. The next item is a little saucy, but I really liked it. So at first, just a normal white top, you know, cool. But then this literally looks like um, <laughs> okay, I don't know if you guys are on the right side of TikTok, but there was this trending humongous baby, like this baby was literally huge, and it was like monstrous. Loki, I was scared of this baby, and it looks like it's um, a clothing piece for that baby. I'll insert the picture of the baby right here so you know what I'm talking about, but and this looks like it was made for him or her. It's a bodysuit, but it's super high-waisted. I actually bought this so I could wear it with the next item I'm gonna show you. I've been wanting a pair of jeans like this for a while, but I didn't even know like what stores sold these kind of pants. I just kept seeing them everywhere, but then this website sold them and I was like, oh my damn. They are these denim jeans like this. They're baggy. I really like the fit of them. But then they have this amazing crossing over detail at the top, which I think just like makes these jeans so much nicer. Like besides the fit and the color of them, like the top, this detailing really just got me. I really like it. It's freaking fantastic. Like I said, I'm over wearing tight pants. So these are like perfect amount of baggy because you can tell that they're like a little bit big, but I don't mind that. I actually like the way that looks. If I could marry a pair of pants, it would be these. The next store I ordered something from uh, was Brandy Melville. It kind of sucks that Brandy Melville was the one selling these jeans, these pants, because I really like them, but I don't necessarily support Brandy Melville. Whatever, I'm just gonna leave it at that. But I got these pants and you might have seen them on like Pinterest or something, but there are these low rise black pants and they flare out. They're really cute. I like the two button detailing. I think that adds a little bit more to it. Just your regular low rise jeans. It's kind of funny how low rise is making a comeback. Like I think that's hilarious. I also got their famous pin choker. I really like the way this looks. I have something similar to it and it's actually from Nasty Gal, but um, instead of a pin, that one's a bar. And I feel like that is a little bit more like you know, does that make sense? This is what it looks like. The next store that I ordered stuff from was PacSun. And let me just say, I haven't purchased something from PacSun since probably like 8th grade. Maybe even 7th. I don't know why, we just had a falling out, like she was talking shit, and I didn't really like that way that she handled the situation. So I did some digging, I looked into their website, and I actually found some things. There was a sale going on, super affordable prices, I was kind of confused because last time I remembered Paxson was like hella expensive for no reason. This shirt actually, anyone who's seen it has literally asked me, so can I borrow that sometime? I don't know why it's just really popular among these people. Dog, shut up! Like I said earlier, it shows your collarbones and that automatically is a win for me. So I bought it. I thought it was a nice basic that I could just throw on when I was struggling to find an outfit. Although, literally after this BS, I don't think um, we're gonna be struggling trying to find outfits because we're literally gonna be like backed up, like stored with outfit ideas. And the last item that I got in this entire haul was this tank top. Unfortunately, I do have to return it because it is a little big on me. I don't know why, but I got a medium. I absolutely love this top. It is so, so soft. It's very, very thin. It's not super thick, which is perfect for summer. And then the top, 
has this really cute lace detailing. It's just a nice cami, you know what I mean? It just, it's perfect for summer. Literally this scream summer. And also the color, it's like this really nice light blue. It's kind of um like a mint green but there's like hints of blue obviously in it. I just thought it was super cute. Those are all of the items that I got in this shopping spree. I will probably be filming one of these quite soon because I'm still bored and this is just how I cope. You know, it's unhealthy, but it works. So we're gonna keep doing it. As I mentioned earlier, I will leave the link to Nasty Gal's website in the description. Their pieces are to die for and their pricing really just does it for you. If you wanna help me, yourself and hundreds of others, Comment down your favorite store because I'm running out of stores and I'm pretty sure you guys are too. I need some new ideas, so please leave them in the comments. I'm begging you. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you guys so, so much and I will see you next week. Bye guys!